Hi friends, how are you guys doing today? Thank you for all your comments, my uh, weight loss videos, and my, I don't think the A1C results video has come out yet. Maybe it has, I don't know. I'm trying to open this water bottle <laughs> handed. A little bit tricky, but thank you for all your comments. It's been really fun to take time today and respond to them same day. I've had some extra time today. Um, I was walking, I was on my treadmill. Let's see how many steps I have done so far today. Um, and I, again, I don't ever say this to make you guys feel guilty if you're not doing these things or whatever, because I, believe me, I was there. Um, oh, Kaylee's texting me, find out what that is. I'm not doing this to make you feel guilty. I want to motivate you if you can. So, um, that's all. But, uh, let's see how many steps I did do really quick. Hang on, let me put you, where can I put you down on a cup? Okay, let's see how many steps I've done. I did a, almost 6,000 on the treadmill. I forgot whatever other oh, it is. Ha <gasps> ha! You're not going to be able to see the number. Maybe you can. 7,000. 7,000. Oh, something's sticky on the floor. Okay, Chelsea doesn't need to sweep today. She needs to mop. Um, and Ashley needs to load. And Abby needs to unload. They'll all do their chores when they get home. So I have showered. I am still working on laundry. I just found some more shirts that I think Chelsea's going to want to pack. So I'm actually going to set them. I don't know where I'm going to set them. I think they need to go upstairs and put, be put right into the suitcase. But I'm going to ask her. But one thing we did discover when I was helping Chelsea pack, because I think we had three pairs of sweatpants <laughs> and no pants, two pairs of shorts, um, and a couple pajamas. I was like, um, we're going into really cold weather to nice events. We have a wedding. We have our wedding clothes. We have a wedding. We have a Christmas party. We have church. And that's the, that's the whole time that we're there. That's what we're doing, going out to a nice dinner. So I was like, can we find some pants that are like nicer, like not formal, but like nicer? And she has a bunch of leggings handed down from other girls, but she says she doesn't want to wear leggings. It's, she doesn't like how restricted it makes her feel. Um, she gets hot and I totally understand where she's coming on this. I think my father-in-law is texting me and Kaylee now trying to find my phone, but it occurred to me late last night, probably at one in the morning when I couldn't sleep, the leggings that I just got from Costco. The little like, they're not yoga pants, but they're not jeggings. They're kind of a slippery, silky material, but they're not silky. I can't find my shoes and I can't find my phone. I found my phone. Let's see who's texting me. Anyway, it just occurred to me um, that I can go get those pants for her. But I want to get them for her and bring them home and have her try them on. Because then I might go buy a couple pair tomorrow if I have time. There's my shoes. Because I think it's the perfect thing for her. I'm going to take a picture of other colors. I think they had two or three colors. And I'm going to, I was going to take her to Target tonight. But I don't think we're going to find what we want at Target. And she probably won't want to try things on at the store anyway. Regardless of, not. I can't reach my shoe. Hang on. Okay, found my shoes. Kaylee's having a hard time with her teachers. We just are trying to get an updated um, like hall pass for her to leave, Kaylee to leave class early because of her knee. She just is really insecure um, in the crowds. She feels like she needs to walk faster when she's in a crowd and then is worried that it's gonna mess up her knee. So I called last week to get the doctor's note and the doctor, the office said, it should be fine. We'll call you either way, but we'll send it straight to the school. We won't even need to go through you guys. We're just going to get it directly to the re to the source. And as Kaylee has been fighting one teacher on the expiration of the first extent, you know, like hall pass note from the doctor, um, she has since found out from all of the teachers that they never even got the first note. I don't know how she was able to leave class in <laughs> that whole time anyway. And she's like, the school never sent it to the teachers. And, and especially this one that's really causing our headache right now. So I don't really know what's going on. I'm gonna go to Costco. I'm gonna get those pants for Chelsea so she can try them on tonight. Um, I might, I'm gonna get two different sizes um, and then I can return them because I really think they're gonna work. So let's go to Costco and I might pop into um, 
Target. I don't really want to. I've been so many times. I never thought I'd say this. I am legit sick of Target. Like, I'm done with Target. But, one thing I didn't show you yesterday in the packing video, we have all of our dress clothes into this little um, dry cleaner bag. I went and had Jason's two dress white shirts um, cleaned and pressed at the dry cleaners. I have, n I don't even know if I've ever done that before. I don't really iron his shirts either, to be fair. If he wants to iron, he has to iron it himself. Um, but I got that cleaned up for him. Um, I brought two just in case he wants to change into a different one for church on Sunday versus the wedding the night before. Um, and then I've got my dress and I've got Ashley's little jumper. You can see the legs sticking down at the bottom. I wonder if Jason packed his pants. I wonder if he packed his dress pants. I'll ask him if he wants me to hang him up in that bag, but we're very close to leaving. And tomorrow I have an extremely busy day. Constant mom taxi. Like most of the stuff I have to do is not for myself. It's literally drop a kid off, pick a pig kid up. Drop that kid off, pick another kid up. Drop this kid off, go to a party. And then wait for someone else to get picked up. <laughs> all day, all day tomorrow. So today is my day. I've gotta get some stuff done. I've been doing my walking, I've edited. I'm gonna edit this video so that we are clear on videos for our entire vacation and beyond. I wanna make sure I have some extra videos just in case we get stuck in weather. Okay, gotta answer that call. Calling myself now, only get pants. Only go in for pants. <laughs> We've already been to Costco three times this week and it's Tuesday. It's Tuesday. It's, it's only Tuesday. We can't come to Costco every day. Our budget can't handle it. Luckily these pants are only two, $10, but I do need to get um, veggie pouches. I did not know that we were out of those and Ashley needs to take some of those with us on our trip. She's really gonna struggle eating. Vacations don't do well with her eating habits because she already struggles at home. So I'm gonna get the veggie pouches and put them in the car. We won't talk about them, I'm just gonna have them available. So two things. I'm not even going to get a car. Here's the pants, you guys. It's the 32 degrees ladies tech joggers. They're 10 bucks. So they come in this color, like a light lilac color, and then like this dark teal greenish color. It's actually the color that's my favorite. <laughs> my, my nails and my purse and my coat. I don't think she'll like these colors, but I've taken a picture of all of them. But I'm gonna get a two sizes in the black because I know she'll like the black. There is another brand over here. This is a different brand. I think this is, oh yeah, it's just a different style. And I don't think she'll like this wide leg. Not a wide leg, but I don't think she'll like the open and non-tight leg on that one. This one has the jogger style where it's cuffed at the end. And I think she'll like that a lot better. And it'll look really cute with her like tennis shoes, so. Okay, so don't tell Jason until he sees this video. I'm gonna get one of these as well. They're 10 bucks and they're really comfortable. I tried it on and it'll look good with my my black pants that I got. And it'll look, I mean, it'll look good with anything, but it's really soft and really cute and it's Eddie Bauer. So I think I'm gonna get them. They're only 10 bucks. Okay, this is the only other thing that I'm going to get. Uh, that one looks like it's open. I'll get one of these guys. I literally just had the thought to call Jason and remind him to get gas in his car before our trip. I literally just thought that. I was like, well, my tank is full, but we're not taking this car. We're taking his car. So I should tell him to like, go ahead and get gas. And he doesn't need to get gas in his car. That's the whole point, which is fantastic. Um, so that's it. That's all I have to do out and about today. So I think I'm gonna go home and avoid all the craziness out here. I just, if I can get these pants for Chelsea here, um, I can have her try them on. And then if they work, she doesn't have to come back out with me tonight. If they don't work or if she wants one other style, there's one other thing that I can think of at Target that we could go and try. Um, but I'm thinking she's gonna like these pants. I'm thinking they're not too tight on her skin. They're loose enough, but they're, you know, soft on the waistband, I think is where she's, she's growing. 
and it's hard when you're growing and it's just hard. So I want it to be soft and comfortable for her. Okay, Chelsea won't be on camera, but she did try on the pants and she does like them. So we're gonna show her the other colors. I took a picture of all the colors. I'm taking this off. She's already down to shorts. <laughs> That's how Chelsea rolls. And we're at Target. Right, Chels? Yeah. I get to show you because you're cute. We are at Target. She wanted candy that she is buying herself, mm -hmm. correct? And we're gonna look for a pair of pants. Should we do that? And then we're gonna go to Costco. It's funny how we're looking for pants while I'm wearing shorts. And you're, yeah, she's, <laughs> this is literally. And like, Crocs. And Crocs. <laughs> Even better. Yeah. With socks. And socks. <laughs> that makes it a whole lot better. So, and then we're gonna go to Costco and um, return. Right there. Yes, I know. Yeah. We're gonna return the one pair of shorts. And, what? or not shorts, pants. Oh, like, you're like, I got a new pair of shorts? Yeah. <laughs> And then we will, um, we'll exchange the one and get one or two more. She did like one of the other colors. So I'm okay. just gonna take her in person and we'll go get it done. And then literally, I just have all of my mom taxi duties tomorrow. <laughs> I won't have to go to a store store, which will be nice. This is literally how she goes to school. Yeah, this is how I went to school today. Yeah, she came home and I was like, oh, I have pants for you and she's like, Oh, oh, she tried them on and then she took them right off and put the shorts back on. Yeah. Yes, there are shorts. Show them your shorts. Yes, I got shorts. Yes, you're walking to Target with shorts on. All right, let's go find you some. Yeah. Strange child. So she's a true Northwest child. Socks and Crocs. <laughs> okay, Chelsea is looking for a candy for herself and for her secret sister, correct? But I have been looking for either a little globe or a little jar like this for Ashley's teacher at school. I'm actually, actually gonna take off the little spoon because it doesn't go with what I wanna do. I'm gonna go home and put a little fake tree in here with some fake snow. And then I'm gonna do a baggie of some candies. I've got some peppermint Yorks here, little cute decorative um, holiday candies. And then I will attach this gift card um, and put some money on this gift card. And then it'll all go inside this little jar and I've seen it on Pinterest and it's gonna be really cute. So I've gotta hurry and pull this off tonight so that she can give it to her tomorrow. Can I keep the spoon? Yes, you can have the spoon. Thank you. Okay, now we're at Costco and we got black and green. See, this is the Greeny. one that matches my, my nails and my purse. Wait, it does? Yeah. <laughs> like and my purse. Exact. <laughs> oh well, it's cute. You'll like those. So now you have two black and one green. Yep, there you go. Okay, back at home, and we're getting her little jar set up. We stole one of my Christmas trees. You're interrupting, Dad? Yeah, I don't think I'm working. I am too. Don't play that, that card. Don't play no, that card. Wow. So we're heating up the hot glue gun. I don't want to ruin the jar, but hot glue will come off of the jar. So we're going to hot glue the tree to the jar. And then we've got a little gift bag of some candies. And then I just glued, or I just taped this gift card. Yeah, it's a Target gift card. Oh, okay, yeah, because she does She loves, like everyone likes Target. She doesn't like Starbucks. Oh, she doesn't? Yeah. Perfect, because Target didn't have any Starbucks gift cards left. She likes so we're gonna stick this down inside next to the tree once we get the tree glued in. And I just think that'll be really cute. Then we'll wrap a little ribbon around the outside and attach a little label saying, to your teacher from Ashley. And then you're gonna put it in a gift bag and carry it to school tomorrow, okay? Because you're not going to school beyond tomorrow. Until next year. That's crazy. <laughs> so far, so cute. Okay, we put the little bag down in there and then we threw in a little candy cane. It gets pretty dark so I can't see once the lid is on. But I think that's really cute. That's a good little teacher gift, okay? Yeah, then it's just like that. So we'll put it into a gift bag and then it'll be all ready to give her. Okay, found a gift bag and some tissue paper and that's all set to go. I have signed her name. I'm not gonna show you the teacher's name, but I have signed her name because Ashley doesn't like her handwriting even though I think she has great cursive handwriting. And then again, don't ruin the gift bags, people. Put the tag on the paper. Then you can reuse the bag because guess what? We reuse this bag from someone else. So there's your tip. Saving the planet. Saving the planet. 
And Dad's making protein pancakes for dinner, yeah, yeah. right? And I'm gonna have my peach sauce on them. And I think we're gonna call it a night because I got a lot to do. I still have to do laundry and pack a few more things. Um, it was fun to shop for Chelsea. I don't, I don't get to shop for her very often. And it was funny because we ran into, well, we ran into her friend at Target today and they're like, oh, funny seeing you here, Chelsea. And I was like, you were texting her not 10 minutes ago. And she's like, oh, I mean, we didn't know she was gonna be at Target. She did, she was on a call. I know, she was on a call with her friend. Hey, if you can convince your mom to bring you to Target, we can hang out together. <laughs> Did not see that one coming, but when I ran into her mom, she's like She's like Is it, are your kids like true Northwest style kids and I was like Chelsea's wearing a sweatshirt shorts and Crocs and socks What do you think <laughs> and she was like yes? Yes, your child grew up in the Northwest <laughs> I was like, Yeah, I mean she's lucky her daughter Eba had um, had pants on but she's like I made her put the pants on to come here But like even then um, She kind of looked a little grunge. <laughs> I'm trying to put my stuff away. I'm, I'm making more messes than I'm cleaning up. Craft tools. Glue gun goes in craft tools. No one has figured out my system yet. But that's okay. Okay. I still have to put laundry away and pack all these shoes into that duffel bag upstairs. So I've got a little bit longer of a night ahead and I'm gonna sit down and eat a protein pancake with Jason and just ignore that it's a carb. With applesauce? No. I put protein in there and it's got applesauce instead, instead of, of oil. Okay. So that's better. And yeah. I added a few extra eggs. It's a little special. A little extra protein. It tastes really good. Okay. Signing. Oh, it's not pancakes. You're making waffles. He doesn't follow a different recipe. Do you legit use the same recipe for both? Nope. You're lying. No, I don't. I can. I don't care. They're really similar. Mm -hmm. Ladies, leave a comment down below if you know the difference between a pancake recipe and a waffle recipe. They're very similar, but an actual it's from similar. scratch recipe, there's one ingredient that's different. Baking soda? Yeah, he knows, but he doesn't care to do anything different. I could make both recipes. I can make them as I can tell I can the make difference. Them as waffles, and you would not be able to tell the difference. Good night, ladies. I have to deal with him for the rest of the night. I will save you. Take care, and we'll see you guys and next time. All you dudes watching, leave a comment below. What? What was Except that? For all the guys watching, you keep acting as if everyone's a woman. That's very sexist. Oh my gosh, Nick is probably the only man that watches. I don't think so. We need we need a couple other guys to comment below. Just say, hey, I'm a dude. I mean, yeah, just say, hi, I'm, I'm a dude. All right, guys, take care. Good night. Of kindness yet.